welcome to my youtube channel my name is max if you're new here hello 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 and welcome if you're returning thank you so much for taking the time to come back to my youtube channel and i really really hope you like this video um i am having a difficult night i've had a difficult afternoon and evening and um, this is mainly because um my helper is gone for her leave so I've pretty much been running mommy errands from school pickup, bringing her back home, changing her school uniform, getting her into school, getting her into home clothes, changing that, um, getting her afternoon snack or late lunch after school, did that, um, had lunch uh, after that she wanted to go play at her friends but the weather was a little bit gloomy so i did not allow her to so we spent the afternoon i'm not feeling well i just got back from a doctor i've got an allergy from the cape town trip it must be the oysters or the beach water i'm not sure what it is but i've got a terrible allergy so i went to go see a doctor i drank some medication earlier today so i was pretty much drowsy and just so medicated in the afternoon and having to run all of those errands for me was just a dread so later in the evening i cooked dinner after cooking dinner i had to go bath my baby because she's a small baby i still bath her i had to go bath her which is normally done by my helper but she isn't around and i did bath my baby after bathing her i changed it to pajamas got dinner ready we ate um and today is thursday uh we take out our garbage like on friday morning but because i'm not a morning person i take it out in i take it out on thursday evening so i had to do that so i've really I pretty much have ha had a very busy afternoon evening um now i'm prepping my daughter's school lunchbox well not entirely i just yeah, um, i want to slice these pineapple i normally get them already sliced but we bought these now in the afternoon because we don't have fruits for her lunch um and unfortunately this bar down the road only had these ones so i need to slice these um yeah and probably we can just use this time to catch up um i just got great news today okay well i've had them for i've i've known about the good news for a while now um it's only that they were only just official today so i got a promotion at work which i'm very very happy about because um i often say Wuti, my work is probably the one thing that i this is like my corporate work why is obama not showing this is like my corporate work my work is very first it's very demanding i travel a lot um i still cross night for my job like that's how hectic things are i cross night for my job i research on my job i i it's it's crazy my job is very demanding and i'm just always working hard so i got a promotion at work so that makes me really really happy so today has been a really good day for me um, yeah, man, I'm just really so grateful firstly to God because um, because I really just think a lot of things um, that happen are not just by our might or strength. Um, a lot of it is really just God's blessing, but over and beyond uh, some of the things that are happening in my life, I'm not really shocked, um, especially because it's, it's stuff that I've always wanted for myself and it's stuff that I've had conversations with God about like God this is where I am this is where I want to see myself this is when I this is what I want to see myself achieve and I think now thanking God for all of that um, is really really crucial because I do understand we would see uh, there is a greater power which is God and beyond just that um, I know that I've sat down and had a conversation with God about it and if anything he has made it possible for me and i'm really really grateful for that so tonight i'm just i'm really in my fields i'm grateful i've been in my fields for a good two weeks because i knew about the promotion about two weeks ago and it's just been really great i appreciate i pre i really appreciate everything that is happening in my life uh, my hard work my dedication my 
non sleepless nights sleepless nights and you know guys it's it really does pay off like good work hard work does pay off and i just want to encourage everyone out there do your part do it great and umvozo ukon And then you will go away I'm not gonna be begging you to stay mm -hmm. So maybe if you asked me yesterday I would handle this shit differently Things are different, I'm a new me That's not gonna happen That's not gonna happen That's not, that's not gonna happen So even if you're asking Even, even if you're asking beautiful gift today a bouquet of roses I absolutely absolutely love them and love roses if you know me this 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 is amazing this is the best gift I love flowers and love roses and I just love everything about them so um yeah I'm going to put them into this space right now so do that with me This is just to say, I had a very rough month last month. There's a goal that I wanted to smash that I couldn't smash. Um, but other things were planned. So I've got other great news, the ones I shared earlier. So I guess this is a congratulations gift to me for that. But yeah, um, yeah, I love the beautiful flowers. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Hi, welcome to my YouTube channel. I already said that, right? Yeah. Hi, guys. 
I am looking crusty as fuck. I'm going to return this car. I had rented out a car for some travel that I was doing. And I just want to give a, a review. So I'm, I rented out a Polo TSI, I think one of the new ones. It's called Trainline or something like that. It's a beautiful car. Beautiful, beautiful car. And I understand the brag now, the guys who drive, um, the guys who drive Polos understand the brag. It's such a comfortable car. It's honestly such a comfortable car. Okay, I'll be back just now. Yeah, I was still saying it's such a comfortable car, guys. Like, one of the reasons uh, I don't I don't want to change my personal car is because my car is quite a comfortable car. Like, and every small car that I've driven, I obviously do not afford a luxury car. A luxury car, I don't afford that. And from the range of cars that I can actually afford, uh, none of them were giving me the comfort that my current personal car has and and now that I've driven this car now that I've driven the Polo guys Polo is such a comfortable car like it's absolutely comfortable I love it so I understand the brag I, I'm just here to say I understand the brag um, I understand why they brag should I fill up should I not fill up hmm. Hmm. I'm not going to fill up. The rule is take it back full. But my travel agent can pick it up. I did a full tank yesterday to come back to Durban. I'm not doing another full tank, I'm sorry. Anyway, yeah guys. Um I'm currently traveling with work intensely, so I thought by now we're done with the projects I'm working on, clearly not. So I am still traveling with work and it's exhausting like I haven't been home in so long I haven't been home in so long and I'm just so happy to be at home I'm so happy so I went and did a holiday in Cape Town immediately after that I didn't spend a day at home I had to travel for work it's just been really hectic and yeah man it's been quite quite hectic but okay i'm happy to be home i'm here for two days i'm leaving again <laughs> I, I, if we're being honest i don't like my life i'm so tired of my life i, I want my normal life back but okay it is what it is uh, i'm leaving again in two days good job we're wrapping up the year now so i should be getting some rest Last week he been eating tatili, but okay, yeah, got cancelled because I needed, I was needed for some work, so I had to leave and cancelled my leave. It's a brand new day. I'm headed out to go for a full body massage, which I am so excited about. I have been extremely, extremely, extremely tired, but I thought um, I should really just treat myself. Too often we don't think about how much our body goes through, like the intensity of work. And sometimes when the body is really just trying to signal to you, Ubuti, I am extremely tired and I need some rest. So I'm headed out now. That's what I'm going to do. I am wearing this skimpy dress mainly because mainly because um I am going to undress anyway. So I decided on something skimpy and simple. I'm carrying this small cute bag and yeah, I'll take you guys with me. Cheers. I'm so excited. I need the rest. It's almost end of the year, so our year-end fatigue has me by the balls. And it's not just only that, I think I'm 
I've got a lot of burnouts as well. I've been working a lot. The travel at work has been intense. I'm just really tired. So I'm taking this time to really just go take care of my body. Oh guys, I love this skin dress. Let me show you. It's not showing nicely. I love the skimpy dress. Look. That's me. That's all of me. So yeah, I'm headed out. Um, I'll see you guys later. Bye! I probably should have my my face done. My nails done. Okay, my nails on bed. I, I just painted my natural nails. I probably should have my... Oh, hot. I should probably have my... Why is my hair can do that? Yeah, man. Mm, headed out to go for a full body massage. I'm so happy. I'm so happy I'm doing this. Not because... Um, I love massages or anything like that. No, the main reason is because I'm burnt out guys and too often we don't take time to just relax and take care of ourselves and I'm just lacking the fact that I was able to oh, what is this? I was able to pick the fact that pick up that I'm, I'm extremely tired and my body needs a rest and that's exactly what I'm doing I, I think that's self-care on another level because um, we only go to like a massage whatever when somebody has taken us to a massage so I just thought I need the rest I'm being extremely tired I've been doing a lot of work there's burnouts there's year end fatigue and I'm like no 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 i gotta treat myself i'm just there like i gotta treat myself i gotta take good care of myself and that's exactly what i'm doing um i've been working hard i did take a little bit of rest when i was in cape town but even then you you have to wake up early because you have to you have to wake up early because you've got a day planned and that entails you waking up and making sure that that entails waking up and making sure waking up and making sure that your plans for the day have been taken care of which means you need to get up for the to-do list the whatever's under your itinerary it's just a lot man it's so a holiday doesn't really feel like a holiday where you're just meant to go rest because you have to take the things off the boxes and it's and it, you've got limited time because it is a holiday um, i don't think we're at a point in our lives where holiday can be two weeks no you've got limited time because it's just a couple of days and you need to finish everything it's just a lot so even a holiday isn't time to rest for us unfortunately so i'm taking the time to really just to really just go rest i'm i'm uh i am late my appointment is for three it's 10 to 3 but it's just down the road it shouldn't i should be there in like two minutes but yeah man that's what i'm doing and i'm so happy i'm taking care of my son which is good that is necessary that is needed i'm really happy that i'm doing that and yeah let's do this let's go get ourselves pampered my daughter actually went on a birthday party last week. I was traveling. Look, guys, the way my work has taken over my life, I I completely like forget about things that I have to do. So my daughter was invited to a birthday party, and I got the invite well in advance, and it completely slipped my mind. So when they were asking on the day, "Hey, is Lee coming?" I'm like, Come to me and I felt so bad so I just asked the mom the other mom to fetch Lily for me and that when I'm back from work um, and that when I'm back from work uh, I would um, when I'm back from work uh, I'm going to uh, go over to their place and just get them a gift which we did in the lot was it yesterday on Friday 
today is a Saturday. We actually we actually did it on a Thursday when I got back. Went to Pavilion, went to Toys R Us, got them a scooter, two-wheeler scooter, which was so nice. I like it, but I wouldn't be happy as a parent if my daughter really got a gift like that. I was very frank about that as well to the mom to say, look, if you don't like the gift, there's the receipt. You could always take it back because personally, I wouldn't like it. Um, I mean, because it can, it's a, it's a good toy. A scooter is a good thing. We've got the beach here, so you can ride it there. It's just that for a girl, I mean, I'm gonna get help by skin and and even today you can tell because my knees are bruised, like they've got scars from from all the bicycle rides that I used to do in Gimlani. So I know very well. I don't appreciate it for that say for that reason. But okay, we still got that. Um, but yeah. I digressed because I was letting you guys know that the way my work is taking over my life, I even forgot to take my daughter to her friend's birthday party, which was so unfair. I'm a poor child. I'm probably... Guys, being a mom is not easy. Having to be able to take care of everything, it's just not easy. Not easy. Work is a lot. You also have to be a mom. It's just... A lot man it's honestly a lot but anyway I feel so good. I just finished my uh, body full body massage experience. It's so amazing. It started off really a uh, gentle because I had requested for medium pressure, and then because of the fatigue that I'm experiencing, I decided no. Let me just ask the lady to change the pressure to high, and I actually did myself a favor because. Yeah, that's what I needed and it felt so good. It really felt so good. I feel so great right now. Um Yeah, I feel I feel relaxed. I feel relaxed. I feel absolutely amazing. I would highly recommend. I would highly highly recommend taking care of yourself. I fully recommend self care. Self care. I fully recommend self care. And you're. I am chatting. I want to find out if my my daughter's at the salon. I want to find out if they're done because um, 
I'm gonna find out if they're done because if they're not, I need to go pick them up. But I had asked them good if they're done and it's not for yet, they should just request Uber back home with my daughter. Hi guys, it's a brand new day. Um, yes, the last time I saw you guys, I was um, I was coming back from a spa a massage. Why is my hair looking like this? But anyway, um, I traveled today, I'm extremely tired. I just got to the place where I'll be staying for the week. Um, I like it's a cute intimate space. I'm tired of been driving for the past five hours. I can't believe a husband of my youth is not is not here. I think I will never I will never have a time. Okay, maybe let me not say I'll never, but I think this is the most appropriate time to have a husband of your youth because Driving five hours, driving five hours, especially for a girl like me, I hate driving. Mm -mm, not for me. It's absolutely not for me. But anyway, yeah, um, yeah, I'm missing my husband of my youth, wherever he is. Um, I just got to where I am, but staying here for a week. Maybe let me show you guys around where I'm staying. Um, it's a cute, intimate space. Oh, I love that curtain. Nice corner here with some coffee stations, some biscuits, um, different coffee. I love these floating shelves, they're so cute. And there's a microwave there. There's a fridge here that has absolutely nothing but milk for the coffee. I have got some cutlery and dishes. I think that's salt and pepper, which is so cute. I don't think there's anything here, it's just some storage space. Love this curtain. I absolutely love this curtain. There's this cute curtain here. And then there's this cute little bed. It's so cute and girly. I absolutely love these um, side bed lamps. They, I've never seen this. They are mounted, not mounted, but they are, yeah, mounted at the and on the ceiling board and then they hang on the side of the bed there's another one there i think it's so cute cute little bed um they had a very nice side bed but it's not they had offered um dinner but i passed home and escort and my mom dished dinner for me so i'll be having that instead i just asked them to bring me something to drink which is this i'm having this for tonight i think it's orange juice i had also orange juice yep orange juice um cute little coffee i mean cute little desk for when i'm doing my work which i will be doing in a few seconds and then there's this hot babe which is me why is my dress so short okay it's not short i've just been doing a lot of working um there's an aircon there i don't know what that is um what is that i don't know but i've, I've just put my shoes slippers my work shoes on the side which look really ugly i could never get over these um side lamps they mounted on the ceiling board i think they're so cute there's storage space there which i've used already it's not a lot they've got an iron thank goodness and an ironing board thank goodness and i've hang, hung some of my stuff which is like my work coveralls uh, the coats I was wearing now, a blazer that I was wearing now, and my work jacket. Um, they've got an ironing board. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. I love this art thing going on here. Aircon. This cute little thing, I don't know what it's called. Um, guys, in 17, they bought us bags. I'm like so happy. Can you see this? They bought us travel bags, which are so necessary because we are always traveling. And then, and then yeah, this is my cute little desk for working. Um, let's get to the bathroom. This is the bathroom. It's a shower here. Cute and intimate a shower. This is the toilet. Vanity there. Cute little vanity as well. Very, very cute. And we also have a bathtub. Which is also very cute. This place looks very homey, I must say. It's cute, intimate, and extremely homey. I love it. Um, 
some vanity here which is so pretty 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 oh i think these are so cute for my panties it's when i have my panties there <laughs> but yeah man this place is cute cute as face yeah i really like it cute 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 Appreciate the chase. Now there's nothing here for me. Yeah. I gotta go, I fly away to one new space. You know, I don't And then you will go away I'm not gonna be begging you for stay mm -hmm. Say maybe if you asked me yesterday I would handle this shit differently Things are different, I'm a new me That's not gonna happen That's not gonna happen That's not, that's not gonna happen So even if you're asking Even, even if you're asking Cause I do What I do And it's time
I'm so bummed because there is load shedding and I went for dinner. Um, well, I ordered, I went for dinner and then I decided it's too cold, like I had the restaurant. So I decided, okay, I am going to have room service. So I ordered room service. Um, what am I having? We've got load shedding, so I ordered um, room service. Oh, I think this is the butternut soup. That's chicken. Voila. This is such a small <laughs> this is such a small meal. Hey look guys, the portion. <laughs> Why is this meal so small? Gansanic Bani. I think you get janky because I didn't have enough for the meal. So, yeah. And some Coca Cola. Good morning, good morning. One of those days where the sun is out, we've been, ha we've been having full forecast in weather. Like, it's just been very gloomy. For the past i think three days this week but today is bright and shiny so i thought i should come greet everyone have yourselves a good wonderful day bye i'm off to site um off to site um i hate being an engineer how do i look when i go to work Somebody asked me that, and I was like, how do you even answer that? But anyway, this is it. Um, wearing goggles, coveralls, which is basically that. And I'm a gozu. It's, um, yeah. Took a nap. I'm just always tired lately. I think um, yeah, and fatigue really just is here to stay. Um, constantly tired. Um, yeah. So I got back from work and I slept. Um, the ladies here realized that I was not there at dinner because we do have dinner at the restaurant. So they came by. Who obviously like close down the curtains in my room and just make it uh, evening ready. I think the whole point of doing that is because um, they do know that we are working, so probably working late, that's why I'm not at dinner. So as she's about to get in and do that, um, like I did signal to her that I'm in. Sorry about that, guys. Um, I was still saying something and then my camera ran out of battery but yeah um just got up from a nap uh the lady got in here to let me know uh she assumed i was not around probably working late so she was just here to close the curtains and light up the room and then she found me here and then i was like oh we don't see you at dinner or we don't see you at dinner i thought you're not around i'm like yeah i'm around just feeling really tired i don't think i'll join the restaurant so you guys can bring room service for me which she did um so i'm just gonna get up now and have that i don't even know what was in the menu um, she just brought the food for me and she remembered that coke <laughs> she remembered that i prefer coke for my drink so she brought me that so i'm just gonna get up now and have the dinner What's for dinner? 
highlight coke absolutely love coke um but yeah uh i think this is barbecue wings and some noodles for starter and this is a pop pop chop something some squash sauce and potato it's supposed to be potato wedges it looks like it's oven baked but i'm not sure um and then some veggies on the side i don't know what's the screen thing guys is it peas Pe something like that well and some green stuff green veggies and squash there i think it's a nice good meal and a good portion of summer out so yeah i'm about to have dinner